So Sheik, Mm -hmm. we've had a lot of fun so far, but we're going to pivot now and we're going to talk about you for a moment, if that's okay with you. Sure. Yeah. Awesome. I think I'm weirder than the show though. So be careful. (laughs) Uh (laughs) Mike's going to cosplay as you next. (laughs) Ooh, uh, dude, I'm here for it. (laughs) You with the mustache. um, You got a great background, very colorful. I also see way back there, it says just chic. Oh, you can see that? that, I wasn't sure how much it shows. It's little right now. It shows. And that just so happens to point us in the direction of your Twitch. Is that correct? Yes. What do you do on Twitch? Can you tell us? So I am a variety streamer on Twitch. Uh, I've been mostly just part-time and doing it as a hobby. But now as I'm doing it more, I am starting to really enjoy it. And hoping that I can bring it into a full time. That's the hopes. But uh, right now, I'm just really enjoying streaming. I'm a variety streamer. So I don't just stream just games or just chatting. On Twitch, like you can literally do like this, where you can just chat with your mm-hmm. your community. And uh, a lot of times, we'll just have conversations. It could be about shows, or it could be about certain video games, or just about life in general. And I really enjoy it because it makes me feel connected to those who follow. Because I don't want just people. I want to feel connected with those who are um, watching my content. Um, And then sometimes I just play video games or we'll do community nights where we play games where others can use their phones. Like certain games, Mm. you can use your phone to connect and you can all play with each other. And so, yeah, I'm really, I'm really enjoying it. I, and I still have some cosplay, but um, instead of focusing on that, I've moved into streaming. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, do you want us to show one of your cosplays, by the way, you sent one in. Yeah, that was one of, uh, that one's one of my favorite, like comic ones. Um, I, I love good. X-Men. I love X-Men. Oh, and, um, Ryan's interested. Yep. Yeah. Check this out. <laughs> so this is you as Jubilee. Ah, nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I loved that. Was uh, a really comfy costume of mine because some of mine are very <laughs> elaborate. I did do, yeah. I did do Maleficent from uh, the Angelina Jolie Maleficent. Wow. And I really, it, it was expensive and it took forever to make. I make my own costumes, by the way. It wow. was just like a, I, I really like to make things. So it was really fun getting into cosplay. But, so, um, yeah. what's your favorite game to play on Twitch? Uh, it can be hard because it kind of go through different types of games right now. I honestly really like the new game, Elden Ring. I don't know if you guys know mm. those. It's Sounds it's a Dark Souls. Though. It's from yep. Dark Souls, uh, and, uh, or the series. And I, it's a very challenging game. It's very hard. Mm. I'm not that great, but I, and far enough in the game where you can summon your friends and so they join you and can go along so for me it's really fun because it's super challenging but it's one of those games like when you defeat things when you get past you're like yes i did it so and the lore is so good but it's very you have to really pay attention to understand the lore of the game so it's not out there in your face it's pretty dark and depressing honestly but it's really fun to, <laughs> it's really fun to play so i enjoyed that one but then i'll also really enjoy this game called muse dash which is very colorful and it's a rhythm game so mm. i just like different things and that one you just kind of like guitar hero like a rhythm game and that one you use cute little waifus <laughs> to like go through it's a waifu <laughs> very cute anime girl and you use them and they hit like the the whatever they use whatever um weapon it's usually like an instrument and they hit Mm. the notes and you have to hit the keys or if you use a controller at the right time and it's just fun because it's like fun japanese music and a lot of my community we like the japanese culture and games and everything so that one's a fun one to play and like kind of get challenged but also just be like it's still relaxing in a sense Mm mm-hmm out of I'm out of Michael and myself. Mike's definitely the gamer. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's definitely into waifus and uh, you know the cosplaying you know, the Japanese culture and stuff. Yeah, <laughs> get your waifu. Uh, no, I mean I I definitely used to do more gaming, but uh, I definitely mm-hmm. love. Have, have you ever done any Legend of Zelda? I know that Breath of the yes. Wild. Yes, right <laughs> that's now. where my name comes from. I stole it. Oh, from, that's right. Um, yeah. She, Ocarina, that was of from time. Ocarina of Time. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I stole this name in high school because my friends all gave each other a nickname and they're like, what do you want? And I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. And then I'm like, oh, I love Sheik. So I'm like, I'm Sheik. Yeah. And it stuck with now I'm still wow. Sheik. Wow. 
You know, actually, yes, Michael game. and I have a tie to the name Chic as well. I just remembered when we first started our band entitled Falling Tower mm -hmm. one summer, it was very hot. And so we ah. pulled off our shirts and put them on our heads and put on my mom's funny giant 80s sunglasses that she still had. And we called ourselves the Fly Sheiks. Mm -hmm. And we had, do you remember that, Mike? And we had a couple songs oh that were specifically gosh. Fly Sheik songs. What songs were you those? Know? I don't remember. I don't remember. It was a long I mean, we time. Probably, we probably just jammed or something. I can, I can imagine it was jamming on like, I mean, yeah, when it was yeah, hot, but we, we, definitely, wanted, we didn't want to wear a shirt. Yeah, but we definitely had a couple. But anyway, so yeah, the Fly Sheik. So we're basically the same. Yeah, yeah we're the same. We're well, and, and Ocarina of Time was what I played a lot. And so I definitely, mm -hmm. I know Sheik and uh, that, that's really cool that you got your name from, from Sheik. Yeah, uh, that I, was I my... think that Sheik shows up in Breath of the Wild, does he, right? I don't know. I've never played yeah. it. Yeah, I played a little bit of it, but like they kind of like, there's a few games where they have like a Sheik character, I think, mm -hmm. like they put them in. I loved Ocarina of Time. That was, I was the first RPG I ever played because mm -hmm. my uncle had it in his room. He felt my uncle fell asleep and I went in there as a little like nine-year-old kid and I went in there and I was like oh sweet like this game like this looks fun <laughs> I started playing it and then I went home told my dad and he was like well we could get it for you I guess and I was like yes and then then I just never stopped playing games yeah that was my first love wow. of a video game <laughs> wow and a cool. star was born mm -hmm. Well, that's all really cool. So everybody at home, uh, Michael's going to include Sheik's links in the description box below. So please be sure to click on those. And if you like gaming or if you just like stuff, hang out with Sheik during things. her live Twitch things. Yeah, things. if you like things, and I know you do, <laughs> just go ahead and click on those links and uh, follow Sheik wherever she wants to be followed. And it should be a good time for all. Yay! And now... 